off 38th Avenue East in Bradenton. This home hid a secret. This happens to be the worst I've seen as far as the smell. Manatee County Animal Welfare Field Supervisor Stephen Bell has worked a number of animal hoarding cases in his 17 year career. This hit differently. In their whole lifespan, they spend in the house without a litter box or any litter. Deputies were called to do a welfare check at the home. Inside, they found the 80 year old homeowner dead from natural causes. They also discovered more than 70 cats living inside. It's just wall to wall animal feces and urine. Using respirators and protective gear, animal welfare officers began removing cats and kittens, but some remain. As traps are set, food and water is left behind for those still here. They're in the walls, in the attic. This is just one of the 54 cats that have been brought here to Manatee County Animal Welfare. They're being treated for a number of things with the goal to get them healthy and into new homes. As peaceful music plays, you can hear how sick some are. We are seeing a lot of upper respiratory infections, parasites, eye infections. Medication and attention, something they've been missing, is given. We're hoping that with our staff and volunteers, um, we'll start to bring the cats out of their shell a little bit and also make them healthier again. A second chance. And they all deserve uh, a home, and if we can get them homes, that's the way to do it. For each cat and kitten. In Manatee County, Kimberly Quizon, Fox 13 News.